Here in scenic Boundary County, Idaho, just a few miles from the Canadian border, locals are used to seeing wildlife. But when Jeremy Hill's wife screamed after seeing three grizzly bears just 40 yards from their home and he didn't know where his kids were, he grabbed his hunting rifle and shot the closest bear three times from his balcony. Hill and just about everyone else in this rural county were stunned when he was charged with illegally killing an endangered species, facing a possible $50,000 fine and a year in jail. Unbelievable. It was, it was not understandable. It was outside the scope of reality for people to understand. After public outcry, the U.S. attorney cut a deal, dumping the criminal charge, but still forcing Hill to pay a $1,000 fine, plus some $20,000 in legal fees. He paid the fine because he took a bear in violation of the Endangered Species Act. Even if a bear is being a nuisance, there are procedures outlined for how to do that. He didn't follow those procedures. The U.S. attorney seems to concede Jeremy Hill fired the first two shots legally in self-defense of his family. But where he crossed the line was in taking the third and final shot after he knew his kids were already safely inside the house. Hill says it was not only the humane thing to do, but a wounded grizzly is an even more dangerous grizzly. We've gotten to a point in this country where people are, are restricted from their ability to defend their homes, their families, and their property from large, very dangerous animals that are unpredictable and are known to kill people. Grizzly attacks are up this year. Experts blame a late spring snow that forced the animals off the mountain in search of food. Not a bear population that, while improving, is still fragile. And there aren't very many bears out there, so we can't spare them. We don't want people killing them if they didn't absolutely have to. Many conservationists wish the U.S. attorney had taken this Idaho grizzly killing all the way to court. But most locals say it's the Endangered Species Act that needs an overhaul, putting people before dangerous predators. In Bonners Ferry, Idaho, Dan Springer, Fox News.